Hi all, Alan here with Part Systems. Joanne on the camera. Walk through this uh, Lexus um, LX470 uh, slash Land Cruiser 100 series build that we just wrapped up yesterday. Uh, so this one had a bit of a, a couple of unique, uh, I'm not going to call them challenges, but requests. Um, so we wanted to go, the client wanted to go with a uh, uh, fridge shroud and combination uh, stove tray. So what we did is kind of amalgamate two of our current designs into one. So this one will take the, this one's specifically made for the uh, National Luna 50 quart fridge freezer. So we see here, this is the, your fridge is going to sit on here. And then inside, of course, we have our stainless steel stove tray inside so we get we get about a uh, total of about 60 inches of extension on this side so uh, the nice thing is is all the venting is in there for the fridge uh, easy to run your cord outside and get it around to the 12 volt outlet um, slide that in then uh, beside that we have also oh I guess I should add to that that in the back side here you can see there's a bit of a void we do that so that there is space for the cord from the fridge when you're, you know, pushing the fridge in and out, that the cord doesn't get bound up inside things. So beside that, we have an eight inch deep cabinet. Um, this is a gear drawer. So this will be used for recovery gear, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. Again, lock in, lock out uh, drawer slides. Um, so this one is, is, is uh, just basically made to hold whatever. I mean, there's, there's nothing specific for this drawer. Um, to the, on the passenger side here, we've also added the cover plate um, on the area here so that you can actually uh, store things down the side here. And of course it uses the locking compression latches. It'll just come around the side here. Um, on this, we also did a 40% rear seat delete. So the customer wanted space for their dogs. Uh, they have two dogs, so that's why the, the eight inch deep drawer. So we just continued the same elevation right straight forward for the 40% rear seat delete. Um, this offers probably about, I would guess about three to four cubic feet of, of storage space inside. Um, and of course this is all bolted right to the rear drawer system. Then the client also wanted to ensure, um, basically they have a, a baby that's or a child that sits in a car seat. They wanted to have uh, some form of guard to keep the dogs from potentially getting over on top of the baby. The baby's only 14 months old, so uh, they wanted to have something to keep the dogs, you know, off the baby if the baby's uh, sleeping or whatever. So we built, we welded this entire steel. Uh, cage in, no sharp edges at all anywhere on this. So this is actually bolted right to the system as well. So that 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 offers a level of protection for the child. So um, this is uh, we also put uh, installed molly uh, molly plate on the side of the uh, kitchen shroud or the sorry the fridge shroud. So it's uh, it's a pretty. Pretty scoop and build. One other thing that we did is we wanted to leave a little bit of a void because there's always long items that may not fit in the drawer. I, it could be a lawn chair, or whatever. So there's space here. We did put the back plate on it so nothing slides out. But also, if you look on the side here, when you fold the seat down and up, we've also left a fairly good void in here so also for lawn chairs longer items and also because we covered up the factory uh child car or the car seat um tether straps uh anchors what we did is we actually built these stainless steel units in right into the uh, build here so those are anchored right through about two inches of solid baltic birch so they're not going anywhere so that's um that's our lc 100 um uh, LX470 build. Now, we can modify this to fit anybody's liking. So if you wanted, for instance, you didn't want a fridge shroud and you wanted a one of our more standard kitchen tunnels, 
that could easily be done. We could put the fridge slide up on this slide. We can, we can configure this any way a person wants. Uh, we can also do a full rear seat delete. And I'll just, while John's filming here, I'm just gonna get a quick measurement so I can tell you, you know, how deep we can build these for if we wanted to have a full sleeping platform here. Um, So we can go 74 inches in total length, so six foot two. So if you did want to, if you do have a LC100 or an LX470, what we can do as well is convert this to an entire flat surface for sleeping, still have your kitchen tunnel, um, et cetera, et cetera, and put a fridge slide. We could put like an alley cab or something on top of the build, but that would give you six foot two of sleeping area. Um, 